Okay folks, let's do this then. So to change the coil in the Falcon tank, it's fairly simple. Alright, first thing I would do is take the top cap off. Half turn does it. And then you're going to flip it round. Now you are going to get some of the residual juice coming out of there. So maybe just have a, a baby wipe or some kitchen roll handy. And you just screw the base off like so. Okay. And there you have your coil. As you can see, this one is all gunked up. Right, it's fit for the bin. So, to remove it, you can use your hands if you want, but I always use a bit of baby wipe or kitchen roll or something just to get that extra grip on it. And you just turn it out like this, see? And it really is that simple, just screws out like so. Okay, okay. And then what we'll do is, we'll throw that to the side. We'll give this base a wee clean out. Alright, now... You can use some kitchen roll, you can put it, run it under water, it's really up to yourself, okay? Then you take your new coil, now this is the M2 coil, alright, but it works the same for M1s or whatever. Burst it out the plaster, you take it like this all, and you just screw it back in. Very simple. So it's nice and tight. Okay, and that's pretty much it. And then what you can do is uh, clean your glass. So your glass pops off, just like so. Just pushes off of the, the top cap. You can clean your glass out a bit. Alright, then it just slides back over like so. You take your top cap, you can give that a wee clean out as well. Always recommend doing some housekeeping on the, the tanks and stuff when you're doing your um, coil change. Just keeps things nice and clean. Alright, just like so. Now again, it would be better if I did this under the tap, but for the demonstration purposes I'm just doing it like so. And then it really is just a case of screwing it back together, like so. And there you have it, and the top cap screws on. Bosh, there you are. Okay.